Hello and welcome to Horseshoe Master How To Videos. In this video we're going to be showing you how to make changes to your classes after you have them already set up. Let's go open Horseshoe Master and get started. We now have Horseshoe Master open. Let's go down to Tournaments and let's go click on Play Singles. Let's go to the Entry Data window first click on singles and as you can see I have already loaded players in this tournament and I've already assigned them classes. At this point in setting up your tournament if you need to make any changes to a player you need to delete a player or you need to change a player's class where you've already assigned the classes all you gotta do is click on that player's name and in Horseshoe Master to delete a player you've got to have or delete delete anything in Horseshoe Master you've got to have the complete row highlighted in blue so to get that highlighted I'm gonna to go to my arrow keys on my keyboard and I'm gonna hit my left arrow key and so that highlights the complete row so now I can hit delete on my keyboard and I get a window up and it asks me do I want to confirm the deletion well I'm going to tell it no since this is just a test so you can hit yes and it'll delete that player now let's go to our play singles icon I have already loaded one of the classes here I've already loaded B class to our singles round robin one, uh, data window let's go load A class okay A class if I tell it to load it's gonna give me court one I'm gonna to go to court one and then I'm gonna to go to court two court three and court four now I'm gonna create the pairings okay I've created the pairings now we're all set up ready to starting entering scores in our data window here to our players as the scores come in but before they start pitching someone comes up and says David Godwin has got to drop out of the tournament for some reason or other before the tournament even starts so how we would get this player out of our tournament would be we have to go delete this class is pairings so we go up here to the delete pairings tell it to delete pairings and you get a window and ask you to confirm tell it yes okay we have deleted the pairings for class A now to get David out we gotta go back to our entry window where we enter the players in the tournament click on singles and we go to David Godwin click on his name and again to get him out we've got to have the complete row highlighted so take your left arrow key and go over and deletes it and now I'm gonna hit delete on my keyboard I get the window up that says delete selected entry and I tell it yes so we have deleted David out of the tournament now that we have David deleted from our tournament let's go back to play singles and we will reload our class A again okay we're gonna tell it to load again alright this is a seven person class now that we've deleted David out of it so we're gonna only need three courts so let's go to court one court two and court three and then we're going to click the option for a buy instead of a pacer and tell it to create pairing okay we have created our pairings for class A again and we are ready to start entering scores into the data window here so that's how you delete a player out of your tournament once it's set up that's about all for this video and we hope we, we have showed you how to successfully delete 
or change a player after your classes is already set up. With that, we would like to wish you a good day.